What is going on brothers of YouTube? Elijah here, back here with another video. Guys, today is gonna to be a different style video. You know, uh, I want you to realize this, man. Uh, we are in a spiritual war right now. And the reason why I say this is because, um, and first of all, if you guys are not really, you know, that spiritual and you're just depending on seamer retention, there's a reason why, you know, you're just now practicing seamer retention after, you know, you being 15 plus years of, of, of being in school, you know, if we weren't in a spiritual war right now, then we would have been learned about seamer retention, you know, uh, but because, you know, the matrix in society is portrayed and the things of the world is all ran by the devil, you know, everything's connected with everything. And so that's why they're portraying nothing but lustful actions. Okay, and we are currently in a spiritual war. And in order for us to win this battle, it's through Jesus Christ. Jesus has already won the battle for us when he died on the cross for us. He already, he already, we already won the battle. So before we get right to the prayer, man, uh, I suggest all of you guys to get saved by Jesus Christ. You know, he is the only way, the truth, and the life. And no one comes to the Father except through him. Um, and some people, a lot of people, they, they believe in an afterlife. Uh, but they just don't believe that, you know, there's going to be a judgment day, right? So we can't depend on our own works in order for us to, you know, win the battle and go into heaven. You know, it's through Jesus Christ and he lived a perfect life. He already died for all of our sins, okay? Before we all fall in short of the glory of God. All right, so um, I, wanted to go, I wanted to go ahead and say that at least before we go into the prayer. So that way, you know, when you say the prayer, you know, you get delivered, but at the same time, you know, you're not really, you know, you're not saved. So I'd suggest all of you guys get saved and get baptized and uh, get the Holy Spirit, man, okay? What I realized, and I'm gonna say two Bible verses that really kind of back up uh, this, this prayer that I'm about to say. Um, and before we get right to the prayer, um, the main thing in order for this prayer to work is to have faith, you know. Um, it says a lot of times in the Bible about faith, you know, having faith. Um, and although you cannot see it, you know, knowing that it's already gonna be done, knowing that Jesus is going to uh, provide you, you know, with the blessing, right? So I know that in Matthew 18 through 19, it says, again, truly I tell you that if two of you on earth agree about anything they ask for, it will be done for them by my Father in heaven. So you need to agree to this prayer, okay? So agree that this, this prayer is going to uh, help you out, okay? As we, if we both agree that, hey, I'm gonna get delivered today from the sexual you know, uh, immorality, sexual sin, then it's going to be done. So have faith. Also, uh, Psalms 50 through 15, and call on me in the day of trouble, I will deliver you and you will honor me, right? So um, if we call on, on Jesus Christ in any given situation, I don't care if you're going through depression, um, you know, you're, you're struggling with masturbation. If you call on him in the day of trouble, he will deliver you. But look, man, this prayer is from the heart. Uh, I want you to just agree with me on this prayer. And again, have faith. You know, you need to have faith in order for this prayer to work. And um, Jesus will, will do great works in your life. You know, it's not, it's not us. It's through Jesus Christ that we receive the power. You know, uh, Philippians 4.13 in the Bible, I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. All right, so what I want you guys to do, okay, is to bow your heads and close your eyes. So listen to this prayer, but agree on this prayer with me. Lord God, we come to you in prayer to say thank you, Lord God, for everything that you've done for us. We come to you to break any masturbation, any lustful thoughts going on inside the person's head, and we come to you to say, it is finished. You've already delivered the person from any unclean spirits. Any unclean spirit from the body is left now. It is broken. It is done in the name of Jesus. We use your power, we use your strength to cleanse the mind and cleanse the body of any unpurified thoughts going on inside of the person's head. I know that he may be struggling, but today it is broken in your name, in the name of the Father. We come to you to clear the subconscious mind. We know what the matrix is trying to do towards the young minds with God, and we come to you to break it off right now. We come to you to say the subconscious mind is cleared. It's only filled with your glory, Lord God, and we come to you to Break it off right now. Break it off from the conscious mind and the subconscious mind in the name of the Father. Thank you, Lord God. We come in agreement today that it is done and it is finished. We have faith that it will be done in your name. Thank you, Lord God. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. I'm telling you guys right now, man, Jesus, you know, and I want you to realize this, man. I still even go, go through uh, deliverances, man. I still go through deliverances. You know, everything in today's society that's surrounded you, you know, the devil is trying to get inside of your soul. But we've already won the battle when Jesus died on the cross, man. So when we have Jesus, I guarantee you that anything going on inside of your life, whether it be masturbation, I guarantee you, okay, he will break that for you, man, right now. He will, he will break that for you. Like the video, okay, the like button, should just be right there. And also, subscribe to the channel if you guys are new. We're gonna be doing spiritual, mental, physical, and also financial growth in the channel. But look, man, 
I'll catch y'all in the next video. Peace.